first time they've ever seen any snow or anything like it and we took them out in the cul-de-sac where we live and they were leaving the cutest footprints. You know, I'm sure all of our neighbors were going out later and wondering what all the prints were about. This is Penny Chicken. She's our two-year-old silky white hen. She comes to us each day at the hospital and sits up front behind the reception desk, greets the clients and the kids play with her and she lays eggs for us here and there. I am an animal science major so we visit a lot of facilities. She was at one of those particular facilities and she was finished with whatever they were doing. We didn't get a full backstory on her. They were going to dispose of her since they were finished and I couldn't let them do that so I asked if I could take her with me. Come on, Roo. One of our clients, a friend of theirs, had found him in a park in a ditch in February. He's freezing, trying to climb out of the ditch, and um, took him to a, the client who brought him in here to have him checked. I picked him up and I carried him back to share him with everybody, and um, it was like instant love. And they passed him to us, and that's where he met Penny Chicken, and they became instant friends, and they've been together ever since. They love to sleep. That's probably their number one thing. So he's often up here in his bed in the hospital, and um, she'll come climb in bed with him, and she'll sit on top of him like an egg, and he curls up underneath her where it's warm, and they'll spend hours like that. Um, sometimes he'll bathe her or chew on her toes, you know, and she just tolerates it. She's never upset with him. She's never, never anything. She just puts up with whatever he gives.